coral reefs. Havens of biodiversity are home to one quarter of all marine species and provide benefits to hundreds of millions of people around the world. Throughout the tropics, coral reefs protect shorelines, provide food, and attract tourists, creating jobs and strengthening economies. Reef species are also being used in treatments for cancer, HIV, and malaria. But today, coral reefs are at risk. They face local pressures from overfishing, poison and blast fishing, pollution from land and sea, and unchecked coastal development. They face global pressures as well. Increasing carbon dioxide in the atmosphere is leading to warming seas, triggering coral bleaching, which leaves reefs weakened and vulnerable. Carbon dioxide is also increasing the ocean's acidity, inhibiting coral growth. These local and global pressures build on each other to weaken the world's reefs, making them susceptible to disease and even death. Against this backdrop, the World Resources Institute and its partners have released Reefs at Risk Revisited. This groundbreaking global analysis presents the most up-to-date maps and the latest information showing where reefs are impacted today. What is the cost of these impacts? And how climate change will increase threats in the future? Reefs at Risk Revisited finds that worldwide more than 60% of reefs are already threatened by local pressures. If climate change continues unchecked, 90% of reefs will be threatened by 2030, and nearly all reefs will be threatened by 2050. Reefs at Risk Revisited is a wake-up call. It gives policymakers, coastal managers, and community leaders tools they need to take action. By nature, coral reefs are resilient. They can recover if we act now to reduce local pressures. Sustainable fishing, reduced pollution, and better coastal management will buy time for reefs. But ultimately, we must lower our carbon emissions in order to save coral reefs. Government officials, business leaders, and individuals need to commit to protecting coral reefs. Together, we can save our reefs, their beauty, and their value.